Aloha and welcome to another unboxing of my box from Japan. The small version. This is the May box and uh, once again it's a small version for $29. And you can see my little cheat sheets here. That's my address which I don't really want public. But this I just learned they actually uh, do a detailed description of what's in the box on the box. So I have a spoiler of what's in the box. One item. But then I was like oh god I can't read this so I stopped. But Anyway, it's the June box, the small box. We're gonna see what's inside. <gasps> Whoa. Well, all right then. Something from One Piece. <laughs> um. Oh my god, there's a Pokeball in there. Hold on, I'll find it later, I'll find it later. We have is, oh, it's like a, a, a pencil board. No, it's a file folder, basically a clear folder. And you know, I may not like be really into One Piece, but this is a pretty good one. It's a nice group shot. And on the back, it is the same. Oh, well, that's kind of disappointing. But I guess because it's a clear file folder, you can kind of see through it, so. But that's a good group shot, I think, of the One Piece crew. I'm okay with this. I may keep it, I may not, but... Oh, sorry about the glare there. But I am I'm, I'm good with that one. Oh god, I'm looking at what's in this and it looks so cool. One at a time, one thing at a time. Uh, okay, we've got a snack. Uh, morok Morokoshi wa Taro, which is this says that. So look, it's in English. Ooh, ah! Except these these corns have paint, which kind of worries me. Um, but it looks like it must be like a corn snack. Here's the back. With a lot of not English. That's okay. Because they tell you everything you need to know. So it's a corn snack. We got a corn chewy snack thing that looks kind of good. Let's we'll go for the other snack. It's another Umaibo. Ooh, it's a shrimpy flavored one. Umai. And I think that's Bo. Uh, it's Ebi. Ebi mayonnaise. Oh my god. Okay, it's shrimp mayonnaise. Is that. Hold on, there we go. Ebi mayonnaise. Ebi is shrimp, and mayonnaise is just how they say mayonnaise. So, shrimp mayonnaise flavor. Um, if you watch my other unboxings, you remember these are like the round wafery things, like a hole in the middle, and they're. So we got, we got two crispy, wafery, typey snacks. Oh my god. There's a Pokeball, guys. There's a Pokeball. I'm not gonna open it, but whatever, sure. Look! It's a Pokeball! It's got a butt- <gasps> The button depresses. Oh my god. Okay, hold on. You stay. That's gonna wait for the Gashapon. This is what I got spoiled for me, but I'm still not really sure what it is. It's- I know it's from Assassination Classroom. Um, which is an anime and manga- oops, sorry, knock the camera. It's an anime and manga I have not seen or read, but it looks cool. I, I'm waiting for it to be over in order to like just consume the whole thing. It looks like you could get the teacher, that girl, the that boy, and the that girl. <laughs> I don't know any of their names, I'm sorry. Um, but I got the cool technically teacher dude, Koro Sensei, and uh, it's a cool little stand thing. That's actually a neat, uh... A neat item. I kind of wish I watched- well, when I do watch the anime or read the manga, then I will know more about it. This- is this a shirt? What is- okay. It's- <laughs> I'm trying to read, like, through the thing. I'll open it, but- it's a shirt! Um, don't know if they realize that most of us here are not the Japanese sizes. Let me tell you a story. Well, not a story. It's basically a Japanese 3L, which is like a triple XL is maybe a medium to large in female sizes here in the United States. So Japanese people are small. And what size is this? Let's see if I can get it on the tag. No, but it is made in China. Um, I can't outright recognize the anime it's from. I we're gonna open it up and we'll see what it is from when we get to that. But for now, it goes on the pile. Okay, so not three Gashapon this time. We only have two. We have a- oh, you can see what's in it. It's cute. A Naruto and a Pokemon. So, through the magic of editing, we're going to- actually, no. Through the magic of editing, we're going to untape this one and have it open. Pokeball is going to be its own. So, this will be open now! And look at the cute little- I think it's Sasuke. This must be from the Boruto or Naruto the Last or whatever it is. But he's got a little Sharingan and a little I blue Sharingan. Okay, listen, I read the Mar the, the the Naruto. I read the Naruto manga all the way through, but I kind of 
read that a while ago. Oh yes, it is from the last Naruto the movie, whatever it is. But he's so cute with his little missing arm spoilers. <laughs> and we'll let you see which ones we could have gotten. There's Sasuke. Is that Sasuke? Yeah, it is Sasuke. So wait. I guess it's pre-arm Sasuke and Kakashi and Minato and oh I like Itachi. Oh I like Shikamaru. A little scarf Naruto and Sasuke, the last version. So actually, I mean I like Sasuke too. I like all the Naruto characters. There are very few Naruto characters I am not a fan of. So I'm okay with crazy double-eyed double-eyed Sasuke. Here's the back for information. Boruto, Naruto the movie. But yeah, so that's a cute thing. Put that in there. And now it's going to be time for Pokemon action! <gasps> Pikachu, I choose you! Oh, okay, how does this open? Pikachu, I choose you! What? Oh. What is this? <laughs> oh my god, it's a little stamp and rotating! Oh my god, okay, okay. Okay, calm down. This is cool. Um, I can't recognize the Pokemon <laughs> in the stamps. But we got that. Come on. Oops. I went too far. Alright, so okay. We got that thing. We've got a that thing. I guess the booklet might tell me. A that thing and a that thing. And I think there's just four. I don't know what any of these are, but this is ridiculously cute. Boop. So hold on. Let's, uh... Open this little thing up here. That might help explain what these are. Oh, there's... Okay, so we didn't get this... Oh gosh, come on camera. You can do it. I believe in you. We didn't get this set. We didn't get this set, I don't think. We didn't get this set. We didn't... What? Okay, maybe we got one of these sets because I'm not... Hmm... Seeing one that we did get. All right, hold on. We gotta investigate. Pokemon, Poke, Pokeball. Go, Poke. How did I get this off before? Why would it come off now? There we go. All right, let's let's look at it. Where where is this thing? Is this thing upside down? Um, is it this? I think it's this. I think we got this set actually. So let's see. Is there like a secret one in each one? Beep. Oh no, it's this guy. Okay, yeah, we did get this one. Yay, so that's what that Pokemon is. Right there. So we got the Monster Ball C. Cute. Either way, this is adorable. And my mom does a lot of scrapbooking stamping stuff. So if I choose, I may let her borrow this for some Pokemon stamping action. So here are the steps. You take the thing off. You roll the one you want. You sploof it in some ink and you stamp, stamp, stamp. But I have never actually seen that before. That is really cute. So let's take this down. Spread stuff around. Because we're going to come back and see the insides of everything. So this is everything that came in the box unpackaged. And now let's open it up and have some fun. Okay, here is everything out in the open. And I guess we will start with this corn snack. It's, it's the potato, it looks like this. It kind of looks exactly like the Umaibo. I wonder if they're made by the same company. They should look. But, eating corn. With a horn. How? Mm -hmm. I look back. Looks like that on the inside. Mm -hmm. Tastes pretty good. I mean, it's a salty, fun kind of corn snack. I would eat that. I would eat that again. The, uh, <laughs> the shrimp mayonnaise umaibo, when I opened it, I was like, whoa, that smells like shrimp. So that also, see, the hole inside. Whee! So let's take a look. Or a look. Let's take a bite. Mm, 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 mm. Huh. Kind of shrimpy. Japan is a weird shrimp flavor. Like, so it tastes like Japan shrimp flavor, which is good. Just look at the little shrimp. Look at the little shrimp at the bottom. He's like, I will cut you. It's fun. It did pretty good. This is not what I was expecting. Less mayonnaise, more... I don't know. It's hard to explain. 
Oh no, I got it on my shirt. The shirt, by the way, two good things. Uh, it's from Kokoro Connect, which I haven't watched that, but at least I recognize the name. Teaching you Japanese again. Ko, ko, ro, ko, ne, kuto. So there's that. The other good part about it is it's a men's size shirt, and it's large enough that it does fit me. It's not, it's not like too bad. So it'll at least do me good. I can just see some people getting this and being like, well, that doesn't fit. That is useless to me. So I feel sad for them. But we saw everything else. You saw this also a close up later. And, or maybe beforehand. Nope, close ups later. Sorry. And this is the uh, Ansatsu Classroom. That's what it's called. Koro Sensei 2D thing. He doesn't like to stay in it though. So he just like lifts right off, but if it's on the ground and you put him in, then he stays! Yay! And then the one piece file folder, here's its little, that's where you can flip it open. So let's take a closer look at everything we got. So I went and looked at what the prices of most of this stuff were, and uh, from what I can find, it's pretty cool. Uh, the One Piece file, it's about 300 yen. I mean, that's kind of standard file, like clear file prices. So we're going to say about 300 yen. The uh, the snacks, we're going to go with the normal 100 to 200 yen a piece. So altogether, maybe two to 400 yen. The Pokemon stamp, I believe it's a Gashapon actually. And it could be 300 to 500 yen, depending uh, on the sites I saw. So that's not too bad. The little uh, Naruto keychain is another Gashapon, so that's 300 yen, about approximately, we'll go with. The Assassination Classroom Dude, the 2.5 flat D or flat, whatever it is. It's a, I'm sorry, it's a uh, flat 2.5 D. It's about 600 yen from where I saw. The t-shirt is a little bit harder to figure out. Um, I found it on a website, but it came in like a pack for $30, and it was like two t-shirts and maybe something else. But, uh, I mean, if you split that in half, I mean, probably about 15 bucks for the shirt. Which is pretty cheap for an anime shirt in Japan, actually. Shirts are kind of ridiculous there, clothing in general. Especially if it's like for fans. Like, it can be like 30 to $50 for a t-shirt. But... We'll give them the benefit of the doubt and say about 15 since they probably got like the two packs and split them up, which is perfectly okay with me, especially because it'll fit. Yay! Altogether, guesstimating, that's about like 3,200 yen, which is just about what I paid for everything. Plus, I got the shipping included, of course. So that this is a this was a good box. It's a doesn't have anything as crazy weird as the Attack on Titan Levi photo bank thing. But this is the first time they've done a t-shirt. I don't know how well that's going to work for them, because like I said, Japanese sizes run super small. Um, I got lucky it's a men's one, but I can see a lot of people not being happy about the t-shirt not fitting them. 
but the little Pokemon stamp thing is so cool. And everything else is it's stuff that I know and I, I don't I mean I don't not like it I actually like a lot of it so this was definitely I don't know if it's my favorite box I think the first one still might be my favorite just from that Totoro lunch or bento box I got but this box rates up there I was pleased good job my box from Japan so this was the May My Box from Japan small version for $29 and free shipping. If you have any questions on any of the stuff in the box or need further clarification or more pictures, just let me know. And I hope you enjoyed. See you next month.